Welcome to Backyard Plus. In this video, we show you how to set up and program the 77726 BYP Gecko control box and the 72094 BYP keypad in a 230 volt spa with two jet pumps. Before we get started, let's go over the tools and parts you will need. Tools you will need, Phillips head screwdriver, small flat blade screwdriver, needle nose vice grips, and needle nose pliers. Parts you will need, Gecko control box, Gecko keypad, Gecko heater, LED light, LED light harness, mounting bracket, and strain relief bushing. Step 1. Loosen the screws and remove the control box lid. Step 2. Remove the wiring harnesses from the terminals on the motherboard. Step 3. Connect pump 2, the 1 speed pump. Connect the black hot wire to K5P white neutral wire to P15, and green ground wire to P29. Step 4. Connect pump 1, the 2-speed pump. Connect the red low-speed wire to K6P, black high-speed wire to K7P, white neutral to P16, and green ground to P28. Step 5. Connect the ozonator if you have one. Connect the ozone black hot wire to P23, white neutral to P35, and green ground wire to P30. Step 6. Connect the circ pump if you have one. Connect the black wire to P25, white wire to P18 for 115 volt, and green wire to P27. Step 7. Connect the heater. Connect the black hot wire to P3, white neutral to P4, and green ground to P5. Step 8. Plug the heater sensor cable into P1. Step 9. Unplug the existing light harness and plug the LED spa light into P33. Step 10. Plug in the Gecko 2 pump keypad into P22. Step 11. Connect the incoming 230 volt power wires. Connect the white neutral wire to N, black hot wire to L1, and green ground wire to the green arrow on the terminal block. For 230 volt operation, remove the brown jumper wire from L2 and P21. Connect the second leg, red wire, to L2. The heater and jet pumps will run at 230 volts. Programming the SPA. After filling the SPA, turn on the power. The display sequence at every startup will be lamp test, software number, software revision, and low level selected. The display will show three dashes during flow verification. If the flow is sufficient, the temperature of the water is displayed on the keypad screen. Step 12. Press and hold the light key for about 20 seconds until you reach the breaker setting menu. The filter cycle duration menu will come up first. Keep holding the light key down until you reach the breaker setting menu, which will appear as B24. The values displayed by the system correspond to 80% of the maximum amperage capacity of the GFI. Press and hold the up and down key to choose the desired value. For example, if you are using a 15 amp breaker, select B12. If you are using a 20 amp breaker, select B16. If you are using a 50 amp breaker, select B40. Press the light key to set the breaker rating. Step 13. Program the low level configurations. Press and hold the pump 1 key for 30 seconds. Press and hold the up and down key to select the new low level configuration. Select L8 for spas with a 2 speed jet pump and a 1 speed jet pump. Select L10 for spas with an added circulation pump. Press the light key to confirm the low level configuration. Step 14. To program the filter cycle duration and number of cycles in a 24 hour period, 
Press and hold the light key down for 5 seconds until you see the letter D. Use the up and down keys to select the duration of the filter cycles and hours. Press the light key again to select the number of filter cycles per day. Press the light key again to choose Celsius or Fahrenheit. Press the light key to return to the main menu. Step 15. Test the LED spotlight. The light icon will turn red when you press the light key. If the LED light fails to come on, power off the spot and turn the bulb around in the harness. If you see HL on the screen, it means your spa is in high limit trip or protection mode. The system has shut the heater down because the temperature at the heater has reached 119 degrees. Do not enter the water. Remove the spa cover and allow the water to cool down. Then shut power off and power your spa up again to reset the system. Good job! Thanks for watching! Our goal here at Backyard Plus is to save you money by avoiding costly service calls for repairs that you could easily do by yourself. If you have any questions or need to place an order, feel free to give us a call at 805-541-9000 or visit us online at BackyardPlus.com.